brothers and sisters take a nice deep breath in hold hold keep holding keep up release brothers and sisters we didn't land on Plymouth Rock Plymouth Rock landed on us Anyhow, let's get to the point of this video. Energy vampire, <laughs> straight up, dude. Plymouth Rock landed on us, that is so brilliant. And I agree. So fam, um, energy vampires, what do you know about an energy vampire? And I have been dealing with, uh, and I've, you know, I've dealt with, being an empath, I've dealt with energy vampires my entire life. Now, the, the woman that I love so much, and I still love her, no matter what her family's like, okay? And I've always wanted, but you know, you can't have your cake and eat it too, okay? We come from a similar background, but I, that's not what I'm getting at. What I'm getting at are energy vampires. And let me tell you about an energy vampire. Her mother will try to suck you dry because I'm gonna tell you, there are people, I'm gonna I'm burn these individuals right now with words. There are individuals out there that are so fucking, I said it, fucking miserable with their lives they'll go to the extent to bring it on to you hence the term energy vampire they only get fulfillment and they only and the only time they actually get get this right family this is actually true shit the only time they feel good about themselves is when they make somebody else feel bad about themselves hence again the word energy vampire so I've been dealing with um family affairs with uh with my wife with my uh fiance's mother right and, and this is just, this is this is just a tip of the iceberg and you know the iceberg is what 10 percent up and 90 percent down i'm giving you the tip of the iceberg this woman likes to make people feel like shit and unless she doesn't feel like make pe and she's she's large she's heavy she's a heavy you know we would call her heavyweight champ if we're talking about fat, fat people Let's be honest here. She can t she so this woman has the audacity to say something to me when I have sharpened my tongue like a sword. I suggest you do the same. Sharpen your tongue like a sword. You don't fuck with people that are smarter than, than you. Or you're going to get a beatdown of a lifetime through words. Words are sharper than the sword. You understand? That's why I said I sharpen my tongue and I do it all day. The pen is sharper than the knife. And we're all aware of this. If you can't dish it, don't put it out there into the universe to come back around to you. And when if it when and when it does, it's not a matter of if or when. When it when it comes back to you, don't don't act like you didn't expect it. You defend these people. You defend and, and anybody in defense of these people that are energy vampires that feed off of negative energy from anybody go to fucking hell because you know what i'm teaching people how to get away from people individuals that are sick in their mind sick in health okay as well as sick in their mind you understand you are what you eat this individual i'm talking about eats awful foods all day every day which so you eat a burger right a burger is dead meat they say you are what you eat are you dead meat no, your body's absorbing the nutrients out of the burger. So necessarily, no, you're not really dead meat. But the point of this, and the reason why I came this up with this analogy, is because yes, you are what you eat, period. And why do I say that? Because what you're ingesting is, what happened to that cow before it was slaughtered? It went through pain, it went through suffering, and it went through, well, a literal hell for a cow in order to be on your plate as no fingers pointed back at me as, 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 so it can be on your plate so when it comes to energy vampires I don't have a fucking tolerance for them and I don't deal with them as a matter of fact I fed this woman on her little energy but not only that I disarmed her the way of okay so if you're a targeted individual yes Am I a targeted individual? For some reason, I'm not targeted. I'm just 
I'm special now. Like I, I beat, the, I beat the targeted bullshit. But that's not the point. So if you can't back up with what you're saying with facts, and if you cannot back up with what you're saying with um, what's the word I'm trying to use with uh, no, if you can't back up the negative in things that you're putting out into the world. You are going to get blessed right back with negativity. And believe me, when you speak to somebody that is really good with English and using their words like myself, you're going to get hurt. Words hurt more than a sword. Believe me, I know it. I've been bullied, but I'm not a bully. And I'm totally against bullies. And this is the reason why I do not let this woman bully me. I'm not, I, don't play, I, don't play around these, I don't play these games. And when I do play them... Believe me, I'm going to cut your head off with my words. That's how I use my words. I have learned psychological manipulation. I've also learned psychological warfare against these individuals in which I grew up in a toxic relationship. And I'm not going to get deep into this with my father who, who adopted me. He was, a, he, was a, he was an energy vampire. So these energy vampires that feed on your negativity, t negativity stop it today. By saying how you feel and tell them to fuck off. With that said, brothers and sisters, I love you, family. Family, I don't reveal this information for no reason. I've been through a lot. I love you, family. You have a great day. Shalom. Blessings.